Yo, what is going on, you guys? This is King Froggy, and welcome back to another Metalhead Reacts. Today, I am finally back, and I am reacting to Joiner Lucas, Ross Kep... 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 That word. Um, it's been a little while since I've done a reaction. Uh, I've been working a lot recently as you saw in my update video um like tomorrow i was supposed to have off but i offered to take an extra shift just because you know i need the money um so i'm gonna be working tomorrow so this is gonna be the last video i put out until my next day off um i don't know when that'll be because i never know the schedule until fucking saturday uh so yeah that's what's happening. Anyway, I have the lyrics pulled up there, and you got the video pulled up here. Let's do it. I remember seeing the first part of this video whenever I did that last live stream. Woke up at seven, my days seem more than I prayed for. Got dressed to head out and ride to school on my skateboard. New kid in class, I sat alone taking notes while the hoodlums were making jokes at the clothes that my mama paid for. Seemed like gay world is a part of some gang invasion, tattoos and initiation, parole and some on probation. Soaking up the vibe as I study for information, cause lately I've been deprived of a normal day. But today on my way to eat lunch, some kid approached me. He told me we should be cool if only he got to know me. Cause on the side of town, I would need some protection. It's crazy rap this and dangerous unless I'm some sort of gangster I'm only safe with the police He said his name was I dapped him up at the buses Was kind of skeptical about him at first Cause I didn't trust him and The more I got to know him I couldn't tell what his motives were Hoping that he was sincere Something told me let go But the only thing on my mind was patience Searching twice for a different life I was tired of waiting Plus me and he had similar views and conversations Infused with knowledge Mainly about school and college That was my truth But regardless he was type cool When I was with him Introduced him to my family They were rocking with her. My mama told her, make sure you look out for my son And before she can finish her sentence He quickly just interjected and said Don't you even stress that I got it under control It's been two months since we met It seems like we've gotten close Some cat approached me and tried to beef with me I just froze And I see pounds and a stomp at home He rid out his clothes Called me his brother and told me he got me to the fullest Even if that means bullets, bullies, gangs, AKs And choppers to the killers That's the realest shit I ever witnessed A few weeks later, my uncle sold me That's crazy like, that's a real friend. I feel like it's going to change later on in the song, but right now, that's like a real friendship. A real relationship. Like, that's what I would do with some of my friends, or that's what I would do with my girl. you damn right I would do that for my girl. Like, no joke. Alana, if you're watching this, if you watch this later, I'd do anything for you, sweetheart. But, uh, yeah, no. It's, uh, he was talking about how, like, uh, him being in high school and all, everybody was in a gang or was a gangster or something like that, you know, and the sad thing is that's not completely inaccurate, especially in big cities, you know. A lot of kids wind up in gangs or, you know, doing stuff like that because if they don't, then a majority of the time they become a target by said gangs because they don't have anybody to protect them. So either you're in a gang being extorted by them or you're outside of a gang being extorted by them. There is no winning with it. And it's sad to think that that's actually a lot of what happens today. 
not a civic A 93 with no license plates and no registration Just thinking about every place I'ma go when I finally get it And then he asked me for a ride around the block Some distance from where I was parking Instantly I knew that spot was sketchy My mama would kill me My intuition told me not to I knew it was wild And plus I knew I had no business or place on that side of town And I read about some chick who went lurking without a sound And got murked and a body found in the dirt With a thousand rounds it was worse than abandoned builders Abandoned villas and scammers and killers Provoking gangsters but maybe I'm overthinking Maybe I might be straight just as long as I pump the brakes And try not to think about it, just trust I'll be fucking safe And then I told him, let's go, hop in He dabbed me up, started telling jokes the whole ride there Had me cracking up as we were getting closer I felt funny, my stomach turned And then he told me, go left, make another turn, go right And drive slow as I look, it was all abandoned and quiet Not a single person in sight, nobody standing in right When I pulled the car to the side, he said, right here, sit still Turn the car off and chill, and I start to panic, he told me, relax then he pulled the keys out the ignition and hopped out and laughed Then my light flashed in an instant He inched on my driver door and I tried to lock it I couldn't, he ripped me right out my seat And then grabbed the side of his jeans And then put out the shoddy and all I heard was a screech And he shot my arm into pieces I'm thinking I must be dreaming And another shot to my chest And my stomach squeezed on my breath And my lungs collapsed And I'm down on my fucking knees asking him why He looked at me, I looked him dead in the eyes And he smashed my face with the barrel Knocked all my teeth to the sky And uh, I heard a sound of the shot he cocked back he pressed the heart against my head and blew my fucking top back I'm still conscious, I'm breathing I'm still moving, no clue as to why I'm not dead All this blood that I'm losing And I heard my car drive off Then I looked up and seen the sun And that was all that I saw Then I heard my conscience tell me Get up, nigga, get up You're losing blood, oh my Don't fall asleep or you'll die Stay awake and move as much as possible There's no time Find some help and try to yell You ain't too well, oh God Wake up, nigga Wake up Damn. Like, I figured it would take a turn, but was not expecting that. That's another big thing that happens today is, like, you get close to someone. And it's not even in this sense of this exact scenario, but it's a case of always getting stabbed in the back and it drives people to be untrusting and it drives people to resent other people or to do things that they had had done to them previously like for example if everybody lies to you then you will eventually start to lie to them just to get them back, even to people that didn't lie to you, or say somebody that bullied you, and then one day you hit a growth spurt, and you're tall, and you start working out, you get strong, you start bullying people because you feel you want that sense of power that you didn't have when you were younger. It's things like that that make today's society especially especially in younger generations so deadly and dangerous it's what drives a lot of these kids who have a rough history to do the things that they do it's because of things like this things that this song is talking about being betrayed by those closest to you being betrayed by the people you trust the most and love the most it's things like that that push people over the edge to do bad things and to do things that they eventually regret, but at the time, they think is a good thing and it's a horrible thing, but they just don't know it yet. Anyway, let's keep going. Woke 
up at seven, my day was worse than I prayed for. Got dressed to head out and down the stairs from the eighth floor. New kid in class, he sat alone taking notes while my niggas were making jokes at the clothes that his mama paid for. Had no family, but was cool with the local gangsters, tattoos, and some on parole and probation for breaking rules. The light was all I knew, all I wanted to do was cruise, smoke weed and say fuck school. Wanted goddess, cause all my role models I would look up to was indicted to young dudes with no logic. I went to church to the pastor, said fuck you, now violent. And this gang that always looked out for me, vouched for me and adopted me Said they wanted to rock with me and I wanted to get down Guess there was something missing, anything comes with a price But it's only one condition, all you gotta do for initiation Is kill an innocent victim and leave them there with no witnesses or no snitches If you do that, you be down with the click And that's for life, so don't you ever think you're getting out of this shit And I thought about it Soaking up the vibe as I study for information Trying to choose my victim, plotting a weakest prey But today on my way to eat lunch, I approached him And told him we should be cool if only I got to know him Cause on the side of town, he would need some protection It's crazy, reckless, and phony Unless he's some sort of gangster, he only saved with the police He said his name was Dick, and I dapped him up at the buses Was kind of skeptical about me at first, cause he didn't trust me Then the more he got to know me, he couldn't tell what my motives were Hoping that I was sincere, but little did he know I was trying to snake him and pop him bricks just need the perfect opportunity, I'm tired of waiting Had murder running through my head, I knew the death was coming He introduced me to his family, I was jealous of him His mama told him, make sure you look out for my son And before she could finish his sentence, I quickly just interjected And said, don't you even stress I got him to the fullest Even if that means bullets, bullies, gangs, AKs, and choppers Till they kill us, I was lying to the fucking limits Took advantage when he said he had that Honda Civic A 93 with no license plates and no registration Just thinking about every place I'ma go when I finally kill him And then I asked him for a ride around the block Some distance from where he was parking Instantly I knew my chance was coming I'm ready to drill him Then he told me let's go Hop in I dabbed him up And started telling jokes The whole ride there Had him cracking up As we were getting closer He felt funny I think he knew something was coming That look he had was enough to tell me But fuck it go right And drive slow as he looked It was all abandoned and quiet Not a single person in sight And nobody standing And right when he pulled the car to the side I said right here sit still Turn the car off and chill Then he started the panic, I told him relax. Then I pulled the keys out the ignition and hopped out and laughed. Seen his light flash in an instant. I inched to his driver door. Then he tried to lock it, he couldn't. I ripped him right out of seat and then grabbed the side of my jeans and then put out the shot. He had cocked it twice till he screamed and then shot his arm into pieces. I'm watching his blood leaking and another shot to his chest. Seen his stomach squeezing his breath and his lungs collapsing. He down to his fucking knees, asking me why. He looked at me, I looked him dead in the eyes and I smashed his face with the barrel, knocked all his teeth to the sky and, and then. Sound of the shot, he cocked back I pressed the heart against his head and blew his fucking top back Fucking car Fuck Fuck Hey, get the fuck out my way, you faggot Fuck Fuck, come on Like our previous, like whenever he started doing it from the other perspective, that was, that was crazy. But very well done. It gives you a look from both sides of the line. And Joyner Lucas has a great way of putting stuff in that way. Like the uh, I'm not racist thing, you know, where he took the perspective of the white guy and the black guy. He did the same thing here. And he's very good at it. Um, like, going into a gang is not a solution to your problems. Especially if they ask you to take another life. Someone who did nothing to you. Who trusted you, who only wanted what was, you know, who only wanted to help you, who only wanted to make sure that you, you know, had someone to look out for you.
And that's sad to know that that is actually things that happens today. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure you leave a like down below. Be sure you subscribe if you're not already. Leave a comment down below naming an artist and a song you want me to check out. And I will get to it in the next video or whenever I can. And I will, of course, see all of you guys in the next video. See ya.